A countdown to kickoff, an exhibit taking you inside pro football hits KC. It says in two days, but Joel Nichols has been telling us that this is actually going to open early because they set everything up early, right? They're all set to go. I mean, they're right at kickoff. And so tomorrow, a day earlier than expected, you'll be able to come here and enjoy this at Union Station. We're with Salim Chowdhury, who's from the Hall of Fame. This is extra special here because this is something the Hall of Fame does traveling exhibits, but this is special. Right. What's unique about this is that we've had a great partnership with the Union Station as well as the Kansas City Chiefs. So we've, we have over 200 artifacts, some of the priceless artifacts in the Pro Football collection uh, in this exhibit here, which in itself is enough for anyone to see. Right. But along with the partnership of the Kansas City Chiefs, they've brought 26 case loads, basically, Man. of objects that the visitors here can see, and that's really going to be an exciting moment in time and experience for everyone to be and here. What fun, and there are a lot of interactive things, too, so if you bring the kids, they're going to have stuff they can see and feel and touch and do something with. This is called the Champions Theater, but it wouldn't be a Champions Theater without a trophy. So Salim is doing something wonderful for us, yes. and he has brought something special in this box. We have our Vince Lombardi trophy. This travels with our show every year, and I have the white gloves on. If you don't win a Lombardi trophy, you can't hold it without the white oh, gloves on. Is that right? right? That's the protocol. Okay. Look so we'll go ahead and put this on display. Absolutely beautiful. So when you come here to the Champions Theater, you can really kind of trace the history of pro football. It goes all the way through Johnny Unitas and Peyton Manning and uh, uh, Walter Payton and Marcus Allen. And then right in the center is this beautiful Lombardi trophy. Look at that. That is absolutely beautiful. Now, this is a trophy that has not been uh, presented to any particular team. This is the Pro Football this Hall, is of the Hall of Fame's trophy. version of the trophy. All right, so let's put her on the pedestal, and we'll take a look, and we'll be very careful, because there's some more nuts and bolts that have to be connected before everybody can come in and look at it. Wow, that is just great. Salim, thanks for showing us that. That's beautiful. Why do you think football has such a role in our American culture for this many years? Well, it's uh, without a doubt the most popular sport in America, and that wasn't always the case. And that basically changed in the late 1950s and into the 60s with the advent and revolution, really, of television and the birth of the Super Bowl. I think those two combinations has really made the game what it is today. And Super Bowl again, Lamar Hunt. One of his kids was playing with a Super Bowl, and he said, hey, there's a name, Super Bowl. A lot of Chiefs history, a lot of football history, a lot of cultural history here at Union Station starting tomorrow and all through the weekend and all through the summer. Back to you. I just won this. <laughs> there you go. Congratulations. Yeah. I love that we got to see it unveiled on much. our show. That's pretty fun. Yeah. Now he's going to go party in Disney World, right? There you go. Thanks, Joel.